Hey guys and welcome to the Watch Our Watch Views with your host DK and we are back with another unboxing. So a quick, yeah, quick wrist check I should say for you. I'm wearing my Orin Kamasu in red on a black and red silicone strap. But I am very excited to say I have a watch here that I don't think has ever been reviewed or unboxed before on the internet and I'm very thankful to Isotope Watches who sent me this one. This is their collaboration with Cool Hunting, uh, I think they're a press and marketing company. This is a particular colorway that they've got going that is to benefit, the sale of which is to benefit refugees. There's only 10 of these being made and I have got one of them and I am so so happy about that. So I'm just going to put aside the press pack because it has my name and address on it. I'm going to take out the watch itself. I am delighted with this, guys. Um, I've been talking to the uh, brand ambassador. I believe his name is Jose. Uh, apologies if that is not your name. I'm terrible for names and I need to get better at it. But I can tell you I have been eyeing off Isotopes watches for a while. I wanted to get one in for review for ages. And they've said, look... We're sorry we were kind of delayed with a couple of things, but would you like a special edition to review? And I said, hell yes, I would. So this is their GMT watch. We're going to unbox it right now. Get into it. First thing off the bat is the box is quite nice, actually. I'm going to zoom in there for you guys. That's better. So the box is quite nice. It's got the isotope logo kind of stamped or stitched in. You've got an isotope leather patch here at the top. Just a nice kind of canvas box. A little bit of scratchy, but it's very, very nice. Actually quite smooth. Pretty good indeed. Clasps on the side. Unsnap those two. Good solid snaps on them. And a little magnet there. And inside. Oh, wow. Okay, let's take a look at this beauty. So this is a seriously different watch. So you can see there, there is a GMT, but there's also a date on this one. So I'm just going to get this off the, uh, the, the watch roll. Oh, there's something inside it. Something inside the watch roll. Hang on. What is inside the watch roll? What the hell is that? I don't know what that is. Is it a spring bar tool, I wonder? So guys, I was finally able to get this thing unwrapped and it does look to be indeed a spring bar tool. So let's just have a little look, see at her. Very, very nice knurling on this tool as well. You can see there it's a mini screwdriver on this side with a little isotope logo there with the little eye on it on both sides. And this side I'm guessing is a spring bar tool. It is indeed a spring bar tool. Nice touch. The only crowd I've seen from a micro brand who've done that, who I've had experience with, I believe, is the Wicked Watch Company run by Pascal. And I've found that it's a very nice little addition to have and something that's very, very cool as well. Also, it's really nice weight to it as well. And it does look like a classy little piece. And it's something if you're stuck at your desk and you're working away and you've got the watch on your wrist, you could just be twirling this while working on the computer. So it is, as I say, their collaboration with this uh, press crowd called Cool Hunting. And it is a very, very cool looking piece. You can see there from the side, it is thick enough, but that's to house a very interesting movement, which I'll go into further in the review. You've got your steined buckle there as well in stainless steel, 22 mil. You have got quick release straps. That says 22, but that says 24. Okay, interesting. Maybe the buckle is 22. I think the buckle might be 22. Uh, let's just check and see what it is. So is it a screw-down crown? It is indeed a screw-down crown. Ooh, lovely smooth winding motion on this one. Very, very nice. The movement inside, I'm going to pop up the details on screen for you guys now. Here it is. It's a bit different. It's not your usual thing that you would have normally with a, a micro brand watch, but this is not a normal micro brand watch, as you can see. So the 24 hour indicator is this little disc thing here around the inside. Very, very unusual. So I'm going to give it a wind and then see how she goes. So it is Swiss made as well. The movement inside is a Swiss movement. I'm going to pull this out and see how this works. Okay, so I can wind the GMT hour hand back. Then winding it this way changes the date. Okay, so you can wind it backwards, but not forwards. Interesting. Not really that big of a deal anyway, but 
I will say actually that that date wheel is very legible in the yellow. There are other colorways of this watch available, by the way. Um, so do keep an eye out. I'll drop links to the watch and the company below. But I'm just going to set this to say if it's eight o'clock, let's set it to nine, just so it's an hour different. The disc is very very cool. Blue second hand is an unusual choice as well. Would have thought maybe red to match the little hand, but it does actually go quite well. It is, of course, a hacking and hand winding movement. You can see there, second hand stops, and you advance the time as such. See the date change over, so I think I might have that set for 8 a.m. Let's just watch this go around. Oh, that's very nice. It jumps over. It's not a... It's not a thing that takes a long time. You've got some loom on those hands as well, as you can see from the tips there. And they're green, so it's a very colorful piece. And if we take a look at the case back, you can actually see there the part of the movement and also the time differences. So London is the home time zone for these things. You can see there as well, isotope GMT, Swiss made, cool hunting, 00 of 99, although I believe there is only actually 10 of these made. I don't believe there is 100 of them made. Uh, 5 GMT SS21 is the model, I believe, and then 200 meters of water resistance. So while this is not a dive watch, you can actually take it diving if you want to. Inside in the package as well, there is also this black leather strap with the yellow things, the yellow stitching. And it is, of course, quick release, same as the canvas. And they did say this one, now they did say this is for the review. It doesn't come with this strap normally, but they did want to send me everything to show off their range, which is okay by me. There is also a bracelet as well. And it's a very nice bracelet if I remember from the website. Very, very good looking bracelet. So you've got those nice links there. You've got yourself your quick release spring bars. It is 24 millimeters, so you are gonna to struggle to get straps for this one a little bit more than you would if it was 22. Push button clasp, milled clasp, of course, 22 mil clasp, and you have three micro adjusts on this one. So I am super excited to review this watch and to go into it in more details in the review. I know I kind of babbled about out in this review in the unboxing, I should say, but I am very excited and big thanks to Isotope for sending this one in to me. I cannot wait to get this one on wrist, edit this footage and get it out to you guys so you get to see this beaut. And I really do think this is something special, something very different different looks it's definitely not your usual gmt nice signed crown as well nice bracelet and they gave me a couple of things to show off for the review so how could i complain guys i have been your host dk this has been the watch star watch reviews this has been the isotope gmt zero collaboration with cool hunting and i'll see you guys next time bye for now